Ever wonder why kids seem to be like little snot factories in winter, churning out sniffles and coughs faster than a tissue factory? Well, there are a few reasons for this. Firstly, the cold weather in winter can weaken their immune systems, making them more susceptible to illness. On top of that, winter tends to bring everyone indoors, creating a playground for germs in crowded spaces. It's like a party where the uninvited guests are cold and flu viruses. Common illnesses that tend to spike in the winter months include the cold, flu, and respiratory infections. All of these come with their own delightful mix of symptoms, from the classic runny nose and fever to rapid breathing and a cough that sounds like a barking seal. But here's an interesting fact. These frequent colds are actually part of their body's way of building up defenses against different viruses. Each cold a child gets is like a training session for their immune system, helping it to become stronger and more efficient. So while it might seem like your child is a magnet for every germ in a 10-mile radius, it's actually their body building up its defenses. Now, let's get to the good stuff. How to manage when your child has turned into a coughing, sneezing, feverish little bundle of joy. First things first, let's address congestion. Congestion is like a traffic jam in your child's nose and it's just as frustrating for them as it is for you. A great way to ease this is by using saline drops. Think of these drops as the traffic police, guiding and clearing the way. These saline drops are safe, easy to use, and work wonders to clear up a stuffy nose. Alongside saline drops, a cool mist humidifier can also be a valuable tool. It's like a personal little cloud that keeps your child's nasal passages moist and helps them breathe easier. But here's a pro tip. Keep those hot water vaporizers at bay. They might seem like a good idea, but they can actually cause burns and aren't recommended in managing cold symptoms. Now let's talk hydration. When your little one is under the weather, it's crucial to keep them hydrated. It's like filling up the gas tank before a long journey. Water is the best option, but if they're not keen on it, there are also water-boosting foods you can include in their diet. Think watermelon, cucumbers, and oranges. These foods are not only hydrating, but also packed with nutrients that can help your child recover faster. But what if it's not just a common cold? Sometimes, cold-like symptoms can be a sign of a bacterial infection like strep throat, especially in children between 5 and 15 years old. Strep throat comes with its own set of challenges, but the good news is it can be treated with antibiotics. It's like calling in the cavalry when things get tough. However, remember that antibiotics should always be used responsibly and only when prescribed by a doctor. With these tips, you're now armed and ready to tackle the winter germs. Remember, it's not about winning every battle against the germs, but helping your child's immune system become a stronger fortress. Stay healthy, folks!